Hello. It has been a little while since I posted. I am very sorry. Let me catch you up. Oh, you're here to inspect? <laughs> I'm so scared. She had to go in for a C-section. <laughs> so, I'm in Florida right now, but I actually went home for a couple weeks because my sister was pregnant and with pregnancies, you just don't know when the baby's coming and she really wanted me to be at the hospital with her. So I ended up staying in Canada for much longer than I anticipated, but it was nice. And I flew home with Layla. Thank you. Are you a TSA? Oh, you're here to inspect? Okay. Where are you? Hey. She's never flown before. Uh huh. So you gotta tell me there's nothing to worry about. I decided that it would be better if Layla was at home for this short period of time that I'll be in Florida now for one because she just loves it at home and she can be free and running around and it's really hot here right now and I and I don't like worrying about that and if she's like it's just too hot in a van and an old van and so I just thought peace of mind she loves it at home my mom loves her she can just hang out for a couple weeks until I get back and uh, while I was at home I learned how to snowboard Good job. <laughs> you can do it. Pretty narrow in here. It's too narrow for myself. <laughs> for my for my body. Let Just... these guys pass. They're Okay, just do narrow turns. Don't go all the way to the edge of the run. There's a whole ass cliff there. Right there? There. No, 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 no. I'm so scared. <laughs> it was fun. <laughs> it was scary, terrifying, very exhilarating and fun. And it's just so cool to learn something new. And my friend who was teaching me, also took me into one of the machines that grooms the hills and um, on one of the days when they were putting together like jumps and stuff for the park at the hill. So that was really cool. And and then of course my sister had her baby, so I got to be with her at the hospital. We only give you oxytocin. Look what I found water in the halls. <laughs> Dude. Hey. Huh? Okay. Sorry, no, go ahead. No, that's okay. Um feels so nice. Oh good. Yeah. Like finally Yeah. So it's been a couple hours. She had to go in for a C-section because the baby wasn't coming out. So I left and got lunch with my other sister and now I'm back with sandwiches. Get to meet the baby. I'm carrying Theo out and um, we're like, I went to take Lydic to see And so now I'm in Florida and uh, there's been just a few small changes. Well, I got some cool new things for the van and I, added a little thing and so let me show you those things and then I think we should go to the beach. Yeah, let's show you what we have going on in my van. 
First edition is this wonderful, beautiful, could not be more thrilled about fridge that my brother actually got me for Christmas. Oh my God, why is it so heavy? Is this a thing on its own? Like it looks like you didn't add. Oh no! <laughs> I think it's the perfect size. Oh my God, that's amazing. It feels like the perfect size. That's awesome. The inclination with that. I, I could have cried. I wasn't expecting it. It was just the best gift that I, I just thank you so much to my brother. I love you. And um, so there's that. And I got a little power bank, just a tiny one, which only powers the fridge for about four hours when it's fully charged. Um, but the fridge also hooks up to the 12 volt that I have a wire running under this carpet. So while I drive, I can cool it. And then the power bank also runs to the 12 volt at the front when I'm driving to charge. So yeah, we got this power bank so far, so good. The next addition that I love is this little table that I added. So I need some lumber for that. I need a piece of plywood and a piece of wood and some things. So that's what we're doing here. Wow, very, very expensive. This is $32, this piece of wood. That's like $40 Canadian. So beautiful, it's so hot. What's your technique? No technique. <laughs> Just go with grain. No, really, I can real nice. Oh, I should have stained that. What can you do? All right. I love it, but like everything else in this van, it is slightly ghetto and um, does need some extra things like maybe two poles or one pole so that I can bring it out farther and have more space to use but uh, so far I've just been using it at like the minimum so it's sturdy enough and does the job and I am okay with that um yeah I love it actually I love it I think that's it those are the little upgrades on my old van I think we should go to the beach now because I'm sweating <laughs> really hoping that the beach would be quiet but it is popping off <laughs> Thank you. 
I love that this beach exists. I wish it was slightly bigger. Um, and also it grosses me the hell out. Like dog poop and pee and then the beach is so small. It's like, bleh. something about it really, really grosses me out. But there's not a lot of options for off-leash areas for people and their dogs. So this is what it is. I'm really glad the tide is low. I'm not walking in knee deep poop and pee water. Ew. Chicken salad for dinner. How does that sound? Shall we make some dinner together? This little canister lasted me forever. I forgot to buy butter or oil, so that's great. Dinner is served. The no CMs are so bad right now. I really want to watch the sunset, but they bite me like crazy. And then it itches so much. And I, and I really don't want to deal with that. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I really want to see the sunset, but I don't want to go back onto the beach, so I'm gonna to go to the bridge and take you with me so you can see the sunset too. We're gonna to leave Sophie in the car with the AC on. Don't freak out, there's AC, she's gonna be fine. I just don't want her on a busy bridge, you know?
road, huh? You okay, buddy? Thanks so much for watching and coming along with me for my day. I love you to the moon and back, and I will see you next time.